Hello, my name is Joost Trent and I'm with the Department of Gastroenterology of the Radboud University Nijmegen Medical Center. Today we are going to present to you the studies from the LOXIST uh, trial. This is a trial performed in patients with polycystic liver disease, treating them with lambreotide. This is an international study which ran from 2007 to 2008 in collaboration with our colleagues from the Leuven Gasthuisberg University. We started we started the study because we saw good effect of somatostatin analogs in two patients with very severe polycystic liver disease. So there was reason to start with the LOXIS study. Luz, can you tell me what kind of patients did we include in this study? We included patients with polycystic liver either due to PCLD or ADPKD. We defined polycystic liver as having more than 20 cysts in the liver. We randomized 54 patients, 32 with uh, polycystic kidneys and 22 uh, with PCLD. We gave lanreotide 120 mg once monthly for 6 months and compared it with placebo. We made a CT scan prior and after the trial and measured liver volume. In addition, all patients completed a symptom-based questionnaire. So, Luz, this study actually included both PCLD patients, but only the liver form, and ADPKD patients. Can you now tell me something more about the patient characteristics of the patients included in the study? Uh, the average age in both groups was 50 years old. Seven males particip participated, four had placebo, and three lanreotide. So, the majority of participants was female. The average liver volume was 4.5 liter, similar in bro both groups. In patients with ADPKD, kidney volume was 1 liter. So, Luz, I'm very interested now to hear the results. We saw that treatment with lanreotide reduced the liver volume with almost 3%, while the placebo group increased to 1.5%. A difference of 240 milliliters. And in patients with ADPKD, we also measured kidney volume. In their lanreotide decreased the renal volume by 1.5%, and in patients on placebo, it grew with 3.5%. Okay, so the treatment was effective. Can okay, you tell me whether it was well tolerated in these patients? Well, there were some side effects, and most notably were diarrhea, abdominal cramps, and nodules at the injection site. And you told us that patients had questionnaires, completed questionnaires. Did they subjectively improve? Uh, yes, they did. Based on lariotides, just their general health uh, aspects better after six months of treatment. And uh, the intensity intensity of abdominal pain increased in placebo uh, while it remains unchanged in the lanreotide group. Well, we are of course wondering what's next. We are not sure whether prolonged treatment of lanreotide is of benefit to these patients. And we will also look in combinations of lanreotide with other drugs in order to see whether this more than lanreotide alone will decrease level volume. 